this help, guys? Does that make me look more presentable? <laughs> I'm really disappointed and really frustrated about earlier. I've been very homesick and things like that. But as we've talked, we want to reveal to you right now. Okay, I'm starting the vlog even though it's chaos here. It's, it's morning, it is time for us to get ready to go catch our boat to Manila. We are rushing and rushing and things are crazy and then of course like a glass jar breaks on the floor and I get glass on my feet and it's just crazy but the kids are eating breakfast and we're just gonna hurry and get to the boat. What time is it now? 7.45 and we need to leave by 8.15, so. We can do this, guys. Yes, we can do egg. My kids are good helpers. Helping with the baby today. Go ahead, you can eat it. Go ahead. Oh. Yummy. <laughs> do you like eggs? What are you trying to do? Mama, can you climb down? Yeah. Mama. Good job. Look how careful Mama. you are. Yes, they are. You can see Raina. You ready to go on our trip? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right, we are here to pick up our good friends that will be traveling with us today, and we're gonna go catch the boat now. Yeah. Okay, let's go up. That's scary. There's more stairs. <laughs> I feel nauseous already. I don't know why, because the last ferry we we rode on, I didn't feel sick. Yeah. But just walking up the steps, I feel. So. Hey, guess what? Yeah. If if ever you need to throw up, you can just go to the side and you know throw up in the ocean, and you're good. Yeah. I feel like I need to see the side. Yeah. Let's go. Come here. That's cool, huh? Right. You ready to sit down? I think so. Okay, let's go. <laughs> the door is kids can eat there with their food sensitivity so I'm excited for a little break <laughs> how do you like our trip today so far no way Ate Dores, how are you feeling that's good that's good <laughs> Shout down to your kids. <laughs> You didn't ask? No. What about the kids? I know. They're in shorts and flip flops. All these crazy rules, last minute, and we have no okay. idea. So we, we don't have ask. we don't have shorts. Okay. John will go ask. The kids are in shorts and flip flops and that's not allowed apparently. Also, it's four o'clock and we don't know when they close, but we got here as fast as we can. So hopefully we figure it out. They're fine except you. Do you have shoes? No. I can't wear sandals. You can put socks on. 
I have to wear socks and sandals. <laughs> Can Ate Doris go in with her, with her sandals? What's the rule? No sandals? Yeah. You can't show your toes in yep. that building? Okay. Do you have any socks I can borrow? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Does this yeah. help guys? Does that make me look more presentable? <laughs> My Pokemon socks. I'm ready. Ready to come in your building. She said this is the office. So it's just dress code. Well they said shoes, but that might work. I'm gonna walk in like I own the place. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm gonna put the camera away because it's like pure chaos out here. Earlier we were crossing the street and it's busy and there was like kids hanging on me and not my kids, different kids asking for money. So I'm gonna put the camera away and I'll let you guys know how it turns out. We made it in. We are in the building. We made it in. Breathe the polluted water, uh, air. <laughs> I'm really disappointed and really frustrated about earlier, but we will tell you guys about that soon. Right now, we're at a very important, special place to us, so we're gonna go do that and then we'll sit down and talk to you about what our plans are. <laughs> right now, disappointed, frustrated. Oh. Hey. Okay, let's go look. Let's go around. Let's walk, walk, walk. So this is actually really crazy. Because since I was young, since I, since I was Esme's age, yung una namin punta dito sa temple na to. So if you guys don't know, kami ni Laura a member ng the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. One of the important uh, edifices or building or kung ano man yung gusto niyo sabihin ay eh itong temple um, if you guys want to know more about this um, here's a link down below where you can uh, na pwede kayong makipag chat dun sa mga uh, missionary nung simbahan namin since I was 7 years old dito kami napuntahin this is such a special place para sa akin at sa aking pamilya and I want I want our the rest of our family gusto kong Gusto ko yung mga bata na ma-experience itong lugar na to. And feel the spirit of the Lord here. And feel the love of the Savior. And hopefully na ma malaman nila, matutunan nila na, you know, kung gano'n sila ka-importante sa, sa Diyos. Kasi, you know, children are, are very important to God. And that our, one thing that we believe here is that the children is one of the most important, you know, um, like it's very important for uh, in the eyes of the Lord. Um, you know, diba yung, yung quote dun sa, sa Matthew, diba? So, anyways, Laura's already inside. Tomorrow, me and Laura will be inside. I will go inside through a session and stuff. And it will be so great. You, yeah. I'm like, wait, rock? If you guys want, just, just remember this is the temple, so please be reverent. But yes, you can. No, there's no poop, I promise. Are you sure that's poop? Yep, that's poop. That is poop. <laughs> A few hours later. We are at the place that we are going to stay for the night. We will show you around tomorrow. And in just a moment, we will sit and we will finally talk more about our plans um, and if we're staying in the Philippines and kind of what our ideas are as far as like getting the dual citizenship um, and what happened today with all of that and what we found out. So, but we're really relieved to be here now. It's been a long day and it's such a cute place. Okay, guys, we're gonna sit down and record this as quickly as we can. It is late and waking up our kid just talking, so we've got separate audio. We're gonna be quick. It's been a long day. There's been a lot of emotions and so we want to highlight what the experience has been being in here, being in Manila today. We were trying to get the dual citizenship thing done today 
We checked the website, we got everything prepared on our end. And then it turns out John doesn't have the right birth certificate, supposedly the birth certificate he's always had. So there's something else he needs to do and luckily he can get it done tomorrow. So he's gonna do it in the morning and it's gonna be fine. He's gonna submit the paperwork and then supposedly it takes three to four months for approval. So that's disappointing that it's gonna take so long. And um, we were really looking forward to the kids um, getting their paperwork submitted today as well. But we found out that it's way more complex, <laughs> I guess. It's crazy, yeah. The bottom line is the kids also didn't have the correct birth certificate that they need here. Mm -hmm. They have their original birth certificate, but there's something else. And it would be really difficult to get them from each state in the U.S. that they were born in. And it would take so much time. And then we found out it's so expensive to get the kids dual citizens. It's like 12K. Each. We have four children. <laughs> so it's not in the budget right now. And then it suddenly doesn't feel as important to me. And so quickly, all of this is to say, so we've lived here for three months. We told you guys that we were going to reevaluate every three months. Mm -hmm. And the first three months was very hard for me to adjust to the Philippines and very, I've been very homesick and things like that. But as we've talked, we want to reveal to you right now. We are such not good vloggers, but, <laughs> and it's late and we're in a hurry. And we're tired. But we really wanted to tell you um, how we're feeling and just keep you guys in the loop. And we're trying to vlog really often every day mm -hmm. as much as we can and share our real feelings. Okay. Three months in, we feel like we want to stay longer than a year. That's the bottom line. And being dual citizen is, would help with that. Yeah. Yeah, but then there's other reasons for the future that I would like to have him be a dual citizen. Um, owning land maybe one day, starting businesses, and adopting kids someday, which has always been my dream. And then that permanence of like having a home here. So that is our big reveal to you guys that we don't know much about the future, <laughs> but we have decided we would like to stay more than a year. Mm -hmm. And so at this point, it's looking frustrating because it's going to take three to four months for him to get approved. And then I have to go get paperwork and get that approved for the immigrant visa and then the permanent residency. Basically to extend that. Yeah. So either way, we might have to go home and then come back or something and it's just I, it was a very emotional day it was very disappointing to me and more than anything i'm so mad that they don't put all of this information on the website i wish that they'd be more organized i gave them that suggestion today and i told them to please do that so thank you so much for watching like i said we're gonna post more often we're hoping that will help our youtube channel and we would love for you guys to help us out by liking commenting sharing and then also check out our patreon account because that will help a lot with the service projects that we do in the philippines and being able to travel to do a lot of good things that we want to do here um, and we're excited to share all of it with you so please subscribe and let us know what you think and what your advice would be in our situation what do you think we should do move forward with the dual citizenship stuff for the kids for me stay here forever go home right away what's your opinion so let us know we'd love to hear from you we love you guys we'll talk to you later we love you okay bye i'll be really busy tonight tomorrow i meant so the kids and i and atidoris are gonna explore this place yay yay yeah. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go all the way up there. Yeah, not really sure where. We we'll just pretend. <laughs> hey, check it out. We can wow. see. Holy crud. <laughs> Sorry, John. 26. What? It just keeps going. I'm going. <laughs> No, it's not. How do you turn it on? I don't know what's gonna happen. It's so dark. But look at this. <laughs>